Huh? Catnap? Huh, what's he up to? <gasps> what the? Is that Bobby? <laughs> My friend. I have returned, and as usual, I've brought you a gift. Good work, Catnap. Good work. <gasps> Guys, I just saw something horrible! Catnap, he's made some sort of deal with the robot claw and... Whoa, whoa, Dog Day, just calm down. What are you trying to tell us? Catnap's hiding something from us. Some sort of dark secret. Hello. Catnap! Catnap! <gasps> Catnap! Well, hello, my dear smiling critters. Is everybody ready to go to sleep? Yeah, I'm getting tired. Yeah. Time to catch some Z's. Well, well, last but not least, close your eyes now, Dog Day. It's time for bed. Catnap, wait! I need to ask you a question. You would tell us if you were doing something dangerous, right? Because, you know, we are like a family after all, aren't we? Oh, of course I would, Dog Day. You know I'd never do anything that might put you all in danger. Okay, if you say so. Now close your eyes, buddy. You're gonna feel all better about this once you drift off to... sleep. Whoa, where am I? Just a dream. I gotta get to the bottom of this catnap stuff. Maybe if I'm lucky, I'll spot some. <gasps> Is that. Kicking chicken? telling you guys it was a smiling critter just like one of us but not one of us ah dog day come on that just doesn't make any sense yeah first of all we're the only smiling critters everyone knows that and second even if it was a smiling critter why would catnap destroy it he loves us yeah i don't know guys maybe you're right hmm I think I just got an idea. All right, guys, you know the drill. Off to bed now. Huh? Oh, guess somebody had a long day. Good night, dog day. Sweet dreams. Alright, now all I have to do is find Catnap and figure out whatever it is he's hiding from us. <gasps> and I think I might know just where to find him. Is that a reject dog day? Oh man, Catnap told us never to go in here. <gasps> what the? Where the heck did all of you come from? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Oh, I'm really sorry, Dog Day. I didn't mean to lie to all of you. I just didn't think you'd understand. 
Where did all these other smiling critters come from? And who have you been talking to in here late at night? Ah, <sighs> that dog day was the voice of an old friend of mine. An old friend who goes by the name of the Prototype. Back before I brought you all to life, I was very lonely. In fact, my only friend wasn't really a friend at all, but just a voice coming from this here chasm. Who goes there? Whoa, whoa! Um, uh, I do? My, my name's Catnap. Catsnap. Oh, please, don't, don't hurt me. I, I didn't mean to cause you any trouble. Trouble? No. You aren't trouble. You are... friend. He was the first friend I'd ever made. Finally, I was no longer alone. I'd come to visit him every day, telling him stories, sharing my deepest, darkest secrets. Oh, I just wish I had more friends like you, Prototype. Friends? I can give you... friends. The Prototype seemed like it wanted to help me, but everything came at a cost. First, you must do me a favor. The Prototype promised me it could make a whole family of critters just like me. No, wait. Please, go! I brought the prototype his sacrifice, just like he asked me to. I brought the prototype food every night. Feeding the monster became my whole life's purpose. Good work, Catnap. Now, bring me more! And that's the day Playcare truly became my hunting grounds. I brought the prototype food every night. Feeding the monster became my whole life's purpose. And he kept his promise, granting me the power to make all of you. Everything was going according to plan. But then, he asked a favor of me that tested my limits. Bring me one of these. He finally made me my family, and now he wanted to take them from me. It just didn't seem fair at all. I couldn't believe it! It was a room full of rejected smiling critters, all with horrible defects that made them unsellable. I felt bad for the poor critters, but it didn't matter. I had found the loophole I needed. So you have been feeding this thing smiling critters? And you don't feel bad about that? Of course I feel bad about it. But what was I supposed to do? Dog day! Better type! What are you doing? That one wasn't for you! Help! Help! You've been holding out on me for far too long. Because of that, I'm going to make your little dog friend suffer like no one ever before. Not if I have anything to say about it. Come out, prototype. I know you're down here. Show yourself. Are you looking for me? Or him? Let Dog Day go! I've given you hundreds of sacrifices, but this one you can't have! Silence! I'm the one in charge here, and it's time you remember that! I gave you everything! You're a fool, Catnap, just like all the others in this factory! And now, you must die! I wouldn't be sure about that. Kicking? Bobby, what are you two doing down here? Kicking woke up in the middle of the night and noticed you were missing. So we decided to follow you. Looks like we got here just in time. Just in time to perish. We'll see about that. Ah! Ah! Get off of me, you stupid critters! Hey, prototype. They aren't stupid critters. They're my family. I need my green hand right now. 
Come on, come on! I should have been watching the door! You may have knocked me down, but I'm not out. It's not over for me yet, player. <laughs> oh yeah? You stronger than this? Oh no, it's... Catnap. No, please! Just give me a few more minutes, I... <coughs> I can defeat him, and we can be rid of him and Poppy for good! Just give me another chance! I've given you enough chances. Come here, it's time to go! No. Fine, then I'll take you by force. Stop! Whatever you do, don't... Jeez, that was pretty brutal. But at least Catnip's out of the way. I gotta find Poppy and make sure she's safe, too. <laughs> this is the final straw, Catnap. You couldn't even defeat a puny human. How on earth were you entrusted to watch over everyone in play care? He's no ordinary human. He's special, obviously. If he was able to escape everyone so far... Silence! <laughs> You were built with the highest quality technology, the most advanced materials Playtime Co. could buy. You were built to destroy, and you couldn't do that. So now, I'll be repossessing your parts. Give them to someone more worthy. Start over all together. Or perhaps, keep them for myself. God knows I'd make better use of them than you ever did. charms. Each of our unique powers, and the power of our love and friendship, just might be enough to bring him back. I hope you're right. Look! I think it's working! <coughs> I, I'm alive? You saved me! It worked! Oh, catnap! No time for hugs, Hoppy. I think we need to get out of here. He's right! Let's go before the backup generator kicks on and that thing tries to finish us off! What the? Where did... Ugh. Catnap, you failure! I'll get you next time. When you trip up again, I'll be there waiting! I'm just glad that thing is dead. I really thought I was a goner for a second. Are you sure he's truly dead? Are you kidding me? He got skewered by that metal hand thing. It was very disturbing. There's no coming back from that. Stay safe, you two. We'll come back for you, Kissy Missy. It's okay. I'll be watching out from up here. Ah! What was that? Kissy Missy. We have to stop the elevator. We have to save her. Press the up button. It's not working! Ugh. We have to get back up there somehow! Come on! Come on! <laughs> Enjoy the ride, fools! Hold on tight!
to my buddy. Poppy? Where'd you go? Talk to me! Poppy? Are you there? It's too dark in here. Let me use my flares. My gas mask. Maybe it'll be fine. Catnap's gone, so that red gas is gone too, right? At least I hope so. Poppy! You're starting to scare me! Uh-oh. That doesn't sound like Poppy. Fire! Help me! Oh, thank God. You're alive! She's alive. And don't worry. She's safe with me. Ah! Catnap! How are you? There's no way you survived that. Looks can be deceiving, player. Maybe I'm tougher than you thought. Well, whether you're the real catnap or some kind of catnap zombie, let her go. <laughs> player, it's past your bedtime. No, no, not again. My gas mask. Ugh. Poppy, did I save her? What the? I'm back at plate care? How did this happen? I just got out of this place. You! <laughs> Put her down right now! As you wish. Where did you... How are you doing this? Oh no, I'm in a dream again, aren't I? You guessed it, and it's more than just a dream this time. You're going to be a part of a little game I made. Lucky you. I don't have time for games. Let Poppy go. I will, if you can outsmart me. And if not, the hour of joy will return. And this time, you and Poppy will be the victims. So follow me and let the games begin. You can't run forever, Catnap. I beat you once. And I can do it again! That freaky teacher better not be here. Last thing I need is another monster to deal with. Sounds like I spoke too soon. <coughs> Wait! That's not Miss Delight! That's Poppy! Where are you? <coughs> Poppy! Water! I'm in here! Get me out! What the? You're not Poppy! <laughs> Looks like you solved my puzzle. I'm almost proud of you. I beat your stupid game. Now give me back Poppy. Oh, player. This was just level one. <laughs> Catnap will be so happy with us. Get him, guys! Uh-oh. When I get out of here and defeat him, you guys are next. Okay, I'm dreaming, right? So, maybe I can stop him if I wake up. But how do I do that? Maybe I can smack myself awake? Oh, okay, maybe that wasn't hard enough. Come on! Of course it's only when I don't want to respawn. Hmm, maybe that will work. I can shock myself awake. All right, this isn't going to be fun, but here goes nothing. It worked! Now I can find Poppy for real. But where is Catnap hiding her? This way! I'm coming for you! Fire! You found me! Now don't touch the fence! It'll zap you right to death! Yeah, I've already been zapped plenty today. Where's... Look who decided to wake up! Any last words, player? I should be asking you the same thing! <laughs> There's no containing someone of my power! What the...? Being non-corporeal has its benefits. What? Who are you? We are the Forgotten Ones. The ones they left behind. The smiling critters no one wanted. You're smiling critters? We are. 
Or at least, we were. Until that wretched CEO threw us away, broke us, locked us in here, never to be seen again. Until you came. I too am a victim of those cruel smiling critters and that evil CEO. And you came here to save us? I... I did! We owe you our undying allegiance, Mr... Frowny Fox. We're going to take revenge on those smiling critters! I have tried time and time again, but I have been alone. Now, with an army of rejects! Hey! That, that, sorry, forgotten folk. We have a fighting chance. Silly Shelly, you take on Hoppy Hopscotch. Clever Claws, you get Bubba Bubba Finn. Molly McMoo, Picky Piggy. Dolly Jaws, you'll fight Dog Day. And Jerry Giraffe gets Crafty Corn. Got it? Then, let's get to work. You couldn't save him, Hoppy. You had to save us first. It just feels wrong. I have to keep betraying him. And this time, he's gone for good. Hoppy. Did you hear that? I don't hear anything. Hoppy. It sounds like him. I don't like this Bubba. I should follow it. None of the state you're in. Don't worry. I'll go after him. I just have a bad feeling that... What's going on? Who are you? <laughs> You'll find out soon enough. Bubba, you're getting warmer. How do you know my name? Don't you recognize my voice? I thought an elephant never forgets. Whoever you are, I found you. <laughs> ah, let me go. Huh, you're weak, and yet I became the reject. What are you talking about? I'm in heaven! All I can eat all the time! Let's just hope I don't get caught. I jinxed it. You can come out. Hoppy? Bubba? Ah! Help me! Come on, sister! Don't have a cow! Hoppy! I heard you screaming and... Let me go! That hurts! <laughs> You're too slow for me! Some smiling critter you are! My name is Clever Claus, and I was not always a toy. I was free once, a real lion cub, living in Africa. I was destined to become the king of my pride, but tragedy struck. I was captured and sold to a horrible man, that evil, horrible CEO. That's where I met Jerry Giraffe, another one of the CEO's kidnapped pets. He wanted to make me powerful. A monstrous smiling critter like Catnap. But his plan misfired, and I just became a regular smiling critter. Completely useless to him. What? You were supposed to be big and powerful. Another large cat to take down Catnap. What a waste of a perfectly good lion. To the trash with you! He stole my life. The life as a king that I was meant to have. All for some stupid toy company. Instead of fulfilling my destiny, I laid with the rest of the trash. Seemingly forever. I was supposed to be part of the safari line of smiling critters. Alongside Clever Claws. This jungle collection is my next great idea. That pathetic little lion might not have worked out, but I'm sure you won't disappoint me. We'll just have to switch from surgery to electroshock therapy is all. Oh, another failure! I guess you safari vermin aren't up to the task! I was never a real animal. I was Molly McMoo, part of the same farm collection as Kickin' Chicken and Piggy Piggy. But I wasn't nearly as popular. Get a load of this 
gross, stinky cow. Big talk coming from a pig. Listen, Molly McMoo, I rule the roost around here. You're just a dirty barn animal. You both tormented me night and day until you bullied me right to my doom. I know what it's like to be the cool smiling critter. I used to be cool myself. A bit too cool. Jolly Jaws, they called me. My mighty teeth scared all the children that played with me. Those kids are right. You are a little intimidating, aren't you? Well, I think I can fix that. The CEO plucked my teeth right out. But who would want a toothless shark? Well, now you're just an ugly normal fish. I guess I should have thought that through. Trial and error is an important part of the creative process, though, I suppose. Do you all remember my story? Why is he so slow? It's like he can't do anything. Hey, Silly Shell, catch! You nearly killed me. Ah, my shell. What on earth is going on here? Look at your shell. How did you do this to yourself? What a shame. All busted up. You're far too fragile to be mass produced, aren't you? But none of that matters anymore. Freddy Fox saved us. And, and he, he will, will conquer, conquer you! you. Ah! My shell! It doesn't matter! None of this matters! As long as Frowny Fox lives, we will never die! Frowny Fox put you up to this? But how? He found us and broke us free. We owed him our lives, and he commanded us to destroy you. We had no issue with doing so. Most of you destroyed us. You are half the reason we spent our days in garbage. Soon, Frowny Fox will rule over all of you. Silly Shell, I'm sorry to have to do this to a fellow smiling critter, but we're getting rid of you for good. Go! Go! You fool! Oops, did I ruin your little experiment? I'll fix it! I'll fix everything! And when my new creation is born, you are done for! Now, at least I stopped him. For now. That machine's gonna blow! I got to get out of here! What? Where am I? Who am I? What am I? I remember being behind that glass in the darkness, and suddenly I'm alive? But how? Mm. Who is that handsome cat? That fancy feline must have been the man who set me free. My savior. My love. I don't know you yet, but I will. And when I do, we'll be together forever. Oh my god, there he is! Oh, it smells like him. Like sweet lavender and handsomeness. Hello? Did someone say something? <sighs> if only I knew his name. Hey, Catnap! Catnap? I heard an explosion earlier. Are you okay? Just another failed CEO scheme. Nothing to worry about, little one. Oh, his name is Catnap, and he's good with kids. That's perfect, like music to my ears. Catnap. Hello, Poppy? Hmm, that was weird. This must be where he lives, and my future home as well. I have to be quiet, but I can't stay here forever. No, I need to find a hideout. <coughs> my darling, I never even knew you existed, but now that I do, I know you're my soulmate. Oh, catnap! 
I've never met anyone else like you in my life. And you never need to again. Now give me some sugar. Katna, please. I'm a lady. We must go on a date first. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Who is laughing? And why do they sound female? But don't worry, I thwarted his plans yet again. Catnap, you're always keeping us safe. Of course, you're my friends. I'll do anything for you. Give me a hug. I love you, Catnap. I love you too, Hoppy. Just the sight of them gives me butterflies. Thanks for helping me get to sleep, Catnap. I keep having nightmares. Who is that? Happy to help. You ready? Yeah. <gasps> so sweet. So lovely. Night night, Catnap. Love you. Well, I can't let this go to waste. Now it's mine forever. What? Who are you? Shh. It's past your bedtime. Catnap, you look even more handsome than ever. Say the line. You too, dear. <laughs> oh, you flatter me. Hmm? He's leaving. I have to follow. Anywhere he goes, I must go to. <coughs> it's tight in here. I need to start watching my figure if I want to impress my man. I'm like his guardian angel, watching over him. You! Mommy Longlegs! Mommy! Mommy Longlegs, I'm not in the mood today. We'll settle this another time. Soulmate. Got a problem with that? Oh, I just thought Catnap had a better taste. I'm the only girl that should be in his life! Catnap! Oh, it is! Oh, my Catnap! I'm going to sleep with this under my pillow and take it everywhere I go! I'll never let it out of my sight. Huh? Run out of humans to chase? I've just been feeling a little weird today. You ever get the feeling someone's watching you? Something just seems off. <gasps> did you hear that? Wait, Poppy? Where did Poppy go? You! Get back here! Let her go! Poppy, are you okay? You won't be okay if you keep getting up on my man! Get up! I need backup! What the? Who are you? It's finally happening! The perfect moment! The first time you see me is when I am defending your honor! What are you talking about? You're not defending me! You're trying to hurt my... my... uh... acquaintance! Let her go! <gasps> 
first touch. It's just as romantic as I dreamed it would be. Okay, you are officially a creep. Get out of here. Leave my friends alone, and I never want to see you again. What? Go! <laughs> Catnap, have you seen any of the girls' smiling critters today? Hmm, I talked to Bobby Bear Hug and Hoppy Hopscotch earlier. I have a feeling something bad might have happened to them. He just doesn't understand. He'd love me if he got to know me. I just need him to give me a chance. Huh? Or maybe he just needs a peace offering. I guess if I'm serious, I should put a ring on it. Maybe they're in here. I know, but she can't hurt you anymore. We don't know where she is, but... Oh, hello, ladies. Catnap, my love. I think we got off on the wrong foot. I am not your love. Maybe not yet, but you will be. I've decided to make things official. Really commit. Therefore, Catnap, you will take this ring and take me as your lawfully wedded wife. Never! I... 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 Of course, my dear. <laughs> Perfect! Uh, let's make it happen as soon as possible! I'm sorry, but I don't want any bridesmaids. Catnap, get them! <laughs> hey! Pick on someone your own size! Lovely! You're going down, girlfriend! Don't worry, Kissy Missy. We got you. I don't think there's a wedding happening today. We object. It's our time to shine. Go! Get as much as you can as fast as you can before we get caught. This is amazing! I'm in heaven! So much food! Where to start? Guys, look what I found! Wow! It looks perfect! Let's dig in! Take a nap after all that cake. Oh, uh, me too. I. <gasps> actually, no, I don't think I need a nap. I actually do really good, you guys. Do you guys do really good? No, you're so totally right. I feel so energized, and life is great right now. Don't you think? Everything is so great. I love you guys so much. You're just such good friends, and I also love them so much, too. Wanna play? We should play right now! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Let's go! We gotta! Let's race! Let's race around the statue! And whoever wins gets the rest of the food in the kitchen! And whoever loses has to do whatever the winner says for a whole day! What about whoever comes in second? We'll figure it out later! One, two, three, go! What are you all doing? Hey! Watch where you're going, guys! Guys? Catnap, do you want to play? Do I want to play? What do you mean? Hey, watch it! That hurts! Let go! What's wrong with you guys? You're acting all funny and it's kind of annoying. We're not acting funny. We're just full. So full of sweets. So sweet and so full. Oh god, you've all got a sugar rush going on. Just play or something till it wears off, okay? I've got a nap to take after chasing around humans all day. You don't have to follow me. By which I mean don't follow me. Please, we just want to hang out. Ah, fine, but I'm taking a nap. I don't have time to play, all right? Psst, Catnap! Catnap! Catnap, wake 
wake up! Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up! What? I've got a question. Why is it that you're so big and we're so small? It's complicated. Catnap, what happens when we die? We can't die. We're toys. We'll live forever. <laughs> Yay! That's good. I don't want to die. Me neither. Good night. But if we did die, what would happen after? Uh, why don't you go play with Bobby Bear Hug? Okay, bye! I'm so glad we're not gonna die! Ah, at last, some peace and quiet. Hey, Catnap, where does the sun go at night and the moon go in the morning? Dog Day, can you please be quiet? Oh, sorry, I will. Thank you. Ah, my tail! Get off! I'll nap later, I need some fresh air. Catnap? Can I give you a makeover? Will it make you all leave me alone? Hmm, yes, but only if you hold still and let me make you really pretty. Then that's fine. And then Hoppy Hopscotch was all like, what? And I was like, yeah, you tell him, girl. <laughs> wow, you're beautiful. Thank you. I definitely feel like the prettiest girl at the party. Now that you're done, can I finally go? You said we could play later, Anna, and you're, you're awake, awake now, again. so you're we should play. play. You, promise. you promise. Just because you're all full of sugar and corn syrup doesn't mean it's my job to entertain you, okay? Now leave me alone. <laughs> he hates me. I'm so sorry. Yeah, it's okay. It's... Wait, seriously, seriously, stop crying. I promise I'll play. You have to do everything we say, or we'll cry again, okay? Ah, fine, fine. Yay, master! <sighs> okay, okay. <laughs> and then Huggy Wuggy ate all the humans and everyone was happy. The end. You're supposed to be asleep. No sleep, no sleep! I'm not tired. Read us another. Uh... A break at last. Good night, me. Canab, I have a question. Why is the sky blue? Oh, Canab, why do we hate humans so much? Canab, why do we bake cookies and cook bacon? Oh, oh man, he fell asleep. It's okay, Catnap. We can play again later tonight. And then in the morning, and then the afternoon, and then night, every day for the rest of forever. <laughs> yep, yeah, especially since we'll never, never die. die. Now's my chance. I have to find somewhere to hide before they find me again, or else it'll never end. They won't look in here. They've already done enough damage. Huh? What's this? Whatever it is, it looks like they ate the entire thing. Oh no! They're going to explode! I have to help them! They need to get all their energy out somehow! Or else that's it for the smiling critters! Why did you leave us, Catnap? Do you hate us? No! I'm trying to help you! The cake you ate is going to make you explode from all the sugar in it! We need to make you throw up or something! Or we can use up all the sugar energy! By playing? Ah, uh, yes, Dog Day, by playing! Well, if you want to help us, let's play tag! You're a catnap! Here I come! How did you know? All right then, I found the rest of you. Just one more. Bobby! Bobby, where are you? Catnap, help me! How did you get up there? I climbed, but now I'm too scared to come down. Okay, we don't have much time left. We have to play. Oh, now you want to play. I don't just want to play. I want to, uh, race. You gotta catch me. Get him! Winner gets a piggyback ride. Loser gets a makeover. It's working! It's working! 
One more lap, everyone! You can do it! I don't feel good. Oof, me neither. I'm gonna win. Uh, I can't believe I'm actually about to do this. Goodbye, home sweet home. Goodbye, play care. Goodbye, smiling critters. But wait, Catnap, you you can't be serious. You're going to leave play care? But what about us? What about your family? <laughs> <laughs> it's too late for all that now. I've already made up my mind. Goodbye, smiling critters. You guys have held me back for far too long. I'm off to do bigger and better things now. We can't let him do this! This is a horrible mistake! So long, Dog Day. So long. Yeah, you heard him. He's made up his mind already. I guess he was never really a smiling critter after all. Goodbye, Catnap. Goodbye forever. A note? Dear Catnap, today I present you with a difficult choice. Leave the factory once and for all, or watch your friends suffer a fiery death? <gasps> what the? I knew there was something fishy going on here. Catnap would never leave us if he wasn't forced to. He, he's our protector. He loves us way too much to do that. Whoa, 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 slow your horses there, Dog Day. We still don't know where this note came from. That just leaves us with one question then, doesn't it? Who wrote the note? I did. And it worked just as I had intended it to. <laughs> it's the CEO! Ugh, I should have known he was behind this. Quite the scheme, eh? Who else could come up with something so clever? Now hold still, won't you? No need to make this more difficult than it has to be. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Dog Day! Get up! Get up! We've got to get out of here! Run! Get back here, smiling critters! Catnap can't save you now! There! If we can get into Home Sweet Home, we should be able to escape into the factory! Yeah, but then what are we going to do? We don't have Catnap! And without Catnap, we don't stand a chance at stopping him! Well, we'll just have to figure something out then, won't we? Ah! <gasps> Baba! Don't worry about me, Dog Day! Just keep running! Get to the factory and find out a way to save us! Gotcha! <laughs> nice try, Critter! <laughs> you can run, Dog Day, but you can't hide! Oh, what the heck am I doing here? How could I leave my friends like this? I'm supposed to be protecting them, aren't I? But then again... Whoever wrote that note didn't mince their words, did they? And I couldn't possibly handle the guilt of knowing I was responsible if any of them got hurt. No, no, no. Focus, Catnap, focus. The note said that if I left the factory, the critters would be safe. So sure, I may have to be lonely for the rest of my days, but it'll all be worth it as long as I know the critters are back at the factory, safe and sound. <gasps> oh no! It must have been a trap! What have I done? <laughs> Finally! 
With catnap gone, play care is back to being my domain. Just as it should be. <laughs> uh, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? If I don't find a way to free the other critters, they're gonna have to suffer a fiery death! And that's like the worst kind of death there is, right? Uh, if only Catnap were here, he, he'd he know what to do. He's big and strong and smart, while I'm just useless and small and weak. Wait, what? Is that what I think it is? A Catnap toy. Hmm, I think I may have an idea. Oh, please. You can squirm around all you like down there, Critters, but it's no use. You aren't getting out of those restraints anytime soon. Ah, and look, just in time. Now oh, I hope you miserable little creatures enjoyed this place while you could, because in just another few minutes, I'm going to blow this entire chamber sky high. And without Katna, there's no one left who can stop me. Think again, CEO. What the? You miserable little! Hold still, mister! This shouldn't hurt a bit! Oh no, no, wait, wait! Oh. Whoa! You did it, Dog Day! Way to go! Yeah, that was awesome! I can't believe you took him out all by yourself! Yeah, well, who said Catnap's the only strong one around here? Besides, you know how the old saying goes, every dog has his day! You fool! It appears your gas isn't quite as potent as your friend Catnap's used to be. Such a pity. Did you fools really think you'd be able to stop me all on your own? Did you really think I was going to be bested by a little toy? Nighty-night. <gasps> Catnap! You're here! You came back to rescue us! Whoa, whoa, slow down, you guys. One at a time. Uh. I was so worried about you, Catnap, but I knew you'd never abandon us. I realized there had to be someone else behind this. Yeah, I only left because I thought I had to in order to keep you guys safe, but now I've learned my lesson. And I'm not letting any of you out of my sight ever again, because I'd rather suffer a fiery death than be without my best friends. Yeah, well, speaking of fiery deaths, we've got bigger fish to fry. Oh no, that's not good. What do we do, Catnap? There's gotta be some way we can turn that timer off, right? I'm not sure, but I think we can send the trolley back up to the surface if we pull that lever. We just need to find a way inside. <gasps> what the? How's it moving? Yeah, who did that? Dog Day! Uh, what's he doing? I think he's trying to sacrifice himself. Not on my watch. Yeah! What do you think you're doing? We've got to get you out of there! What does it look like I'm doing? I'm saving all of you! Saving all of us? Yeah! With you being gone, I knew I had to step up and be the leader I was made to be! But I failed to rescue the others from the CEO without your help! I have to do this one last thing to prove myself! Oh, Dog Day. I understand how you feel, but there's no reason you have to die while saving the others! Now stand back! Oh, jeez! We're so high up! What do we do? We'll never make it! Here goes nothing! Come on, guys! Move it! It's still hot on our trail! <laughs> what is that thing anyway? Whatever it is! It's big and mean and wants to eat us for dinner! No way! I'm not gonna be fried chicken! Chicken chicken! There's nothing we could do for him now! We gotta keep moving and watch out for more traps! You never know what could be just around the corner! You've got to run! Warn the others before it's too late! Wait! No! Wait! Ah! This isn't fair! What did we do to deserve this? Oh, 
after we do to deserve this. <laughs> Pathetic. Who, who are you? You don't remember me. No matter. Perhaps this will jog your memory. Wait, no! Don't! Please! Leave her alone! Stand back, Hobby. I'll take care of this. <laughs> you. Always the hero. Aren't you, catnip? <sighs> when it comes to my friends, absolutely. And you're nothing more than a big bully. Bully? Wait, that's how I know you! You're... you're... <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's me, Bulltrap. Bulltrap? Now how do I know that name? <laughs> Allow me to remind you of the legend of the Dark Critter. It was many years ago that reject frowny fox just flopped in the stores and the Smiling Critter's brand was at an all-time low. No one at Playtime Co. had a single clue what to do, except for one genius employee, my creator. In order to get the true edge they needed, he knew it was time to take some chances. They needed a true X Factor. Lucky for him, he had just the thing. Before I knew it, I sprung into being, like a roaring fire emerging from a single spark. Creator was overjoyed. He knew I had just the right amount of spice to kick the Smiling Critter's brand back into high gear. Before he went off to tell the tales of his success to the CEO, he brought me to home sweet home in order to play with my new family, the Smiling Critters. I was shy at first, worried that I wouldn't fit in, but those feelings quickly buckled under my strength. Huh? Who's the cow? I'm Bolt Trap. Good to meet me. Um, well, hiya, Bolt Trap. I'm Hoppy. Uh huh. And who's that loser over there? Hey, Brownie Fox isn't a loser. He's just sensitive. Don't be a bully. Ugh, fine. I'll make nice with the little crybaby. Hey, what's your reading? Uh, uh, uh p poetry? Really? I love poetry. Y you do? Yeah. It is one. Roses are red, violets are blue. The stupid grey fox is about to be both, too. Wait, wait, wait! Hey! What do you think you're doing? He's establishing the pecking order around here. And it's about time, too. Brownie Fox was giving us a bad name anyway. This isn't right! Hey, Bulltrap, stop! Why? Are your boyfriend or something? What? No! Of course not! <laughs> <laughs> Hoppy and Frowny sitting in a tree. K R S S R N G. Stop it! Leave us alone, you big bully! I could feel it. The energy from picking on losers gave me strength. I wanted more. And luckily, I was given plenty of opportunities to get it. I was on top of the world. Soon, I had the run of home sweet home, and life was good. soon find out that despite being the king of play care, there were always challenges to the throne. I'm telling you, Dog Day, this has gone too far! Uh, hey, uh, what happened to you? Bulltrap, what happened to you? Bulltrap? Ah, who does he think he is anyways? 
coming here and acting like he owns the place. You're the leader here, not him. He thinks he can boss us around just because he's bigger than us? Hey, wait a minute. That gives me an idea. Meet me at the incinerator. We've got a bully to bully. Sup, pipsqueaks. You ain't a pay homage to your king. Not quite. Oh, catnap! C catnap? So you're the one who's been terrorizing my friends, eh? Well, uh, th they started it. That's not how they tell it. You know, Bulltrap, I don't quite think you're on brand for us. You see, we all got our start as humans, whereas you, well, you're just a stupid little toy. And we simply don't want to play with you anymore. So, you're fired! No! Or we return! And I did. Luckily for me, your little friend soon sent Fowley Fox down to join me. I was able to feed off that reject's energy long enough to sustain myself and grow into this magnificent face you see before you with my new form. I'm unstoppable. His pendant! That's what gives him his power! Kidnap! Keep him busy! Right. Well, Bull Trap, now's your chance for revenge. Come get some! I got it! Here goes nothing! No! My pendant! What have you done? No! Not so big now, huh? You haven't seen the last of me! You'll be sorry! No! Oh. <laughs> Should we let him go? No, let him go. Bullies like him only feed off of our attention. Ignore them completely and, well, they simply disappear.